So I am back with my second video. This is just really different knowing that I'm uh, just gonna let the camera roll and no edits or redos. So I'm, I'm actually kind of loving it. It's really funny when you don't focus on uh, being perfect. It's very freeing. So I hope you're enjoying it. This is kind of fun for me. Uh, so here's what's on my mind today. My In my business, I have two different tracks, if you will. So I am a strategic change consultant and I am so fortunate to have two amazing local organizations that contract with me for strategic change consulting. And I've always really enjoyed that work. I've got a high level of expertise and I've been doing it for about eight years. The other arm of my business is helping professional women rise in their careers. And that is the side that just really lights me up. I love doing that work. And this morning I did a webinar. We had 13 people sign up for it and I had eight people join us for the webinar, which was super cool. And I, I was thinking about it afterwards and I would love to spend more of my time in that side of the business. So I do keynotes, I do workshops, I do one-on-one -on -one coaching, things like that. But it is not to the point where I can really go all in and put all my energy on that side of the business. And I don't know when that's going to happen. I know that it will, you know, these, these things just take time. And hey, listen, I'm incredibly fortunate that I really, really like doing the change management consulting. So it's not like that work is drudgery for me. It's just not where I would rather spend the majority of my day if I, if I could choose between the two sides. And I share that with you because I know that I'll get there. It just takes time, one foot in front of the other, doing things like the webinar, which engaged people. I got great emails. People were super responsive inside the chat. And um, so I know that the work that I'm doing there is resonating. I just need to put in the work to help it grow. So if you have a side hustle that you dream about being your full-time business, uh, just keep putting in the work, right? One foot in front of the other, little by little, and it will grow to the point that you can step into it full-time when the time is right for you. So that's what's on my mind today. Uh, just really grateful for the amazing clients that I do have. And I'm seeing more and more demand on the side of the business, which is helping professional women rise in their careers. Uh, one thing that did impact that side of my business was the keynote speaking opportunities and the workshops that I had coming up in the first half of this year. Obviously those things are all shut down for now, but that's a temporary, you know, little setback, right? And I'm really looking at it as there's just going to be more opportunity later in the year. And many of those uh, events and engagements have been rescheduled. So I know that that will continue and I'll be able to grow that side of the business even more once we get past this shelter in, in place um, situation that we find ourselves in. So if you find yourself thinking, gosh, you know, I, I'm doing this and it's paying the bills and I really, really want to do this over here, do both. You can do it. And uh, together we'll take one step at a time and that's how we make our dreams come true. So I would say keep moving forward with that big dream that you have. Don't let it go. And let me know if you find yourself in a similar situation in the comments. Have a great day and I will see you tomorrow.